Understanding Child Spacing, a Guide for English Learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the phrase child spacing. This concept might be new to some of you, so we'll break it down, look at its usage, and understand its importance in everyday conversation and writing. Child spacing refers to the practice of planning and delaying pregnancies to allow a period of time between the birth of one child and the conception of the next. This term is often used in discussions related to family planning, health care, and parenting. Understanding this phrase is important, as it's commonly used in conversations about family life and health education. In this section, we delve into why child spacing is important. It's not just a family planning term. It has significant implications for the health of the mother and the children. We'll explore how child spacing can lead to better health outcomes and the overall well-being of families. Let's put child spacing into context. Here, we'll see some example sentences that will help you understand how to use this phrase in everyday English. The doctor advised them on the benefits of child spacing for maternal health. Many governments promote child spacing as a part of public health policy. Child spacing isn't just a medical term. It's also influenced by cultural and social factors. In this section, we discuss how different cultures view child spacing and the various factors that influence a family's decision about how to space their children. Thank you for joining us in exploring the meaning and use of child spacing. We hope this video has been informative and helpful in expanding your understanding of English phrases related to family and health. Remember, Learning a language is about understanding the words and the cultural context behind them. See you in our next video.